Hello and welcome to Cozy's Corner. As you can see, I have two new friends with me here today. Can you say hi, Gloria? Hi, Jeffrey. Gloria and Jeffrey are two beautiful birds painted by my friend Sarah. She has her own business called Art by Sarah, and I've popped the link below the video for you. Okay, well, I'm so excited today because I'm going to show you how to make your very own homemade bubble recipe. So exciting. So what you'll need is you'll need some kind of bowl, mixing bowl. Um, I've got my glass bowl here. You'll need seven parts water. Um, you're gonna need three parts of morning fresh original dishwashing liquid and one part of glycerin, okay? So you can find this in chemists or supermarkets. And don't forget the wand that we made in our other video before. So this is our homemade wand. I've just put some sticky tape so it stays and hopefully it works. We'll try it in a minute. Okay, so I'm excited. We're going to pour the seven parts of water into our bowl. Ooh. Okay, I'm going to get our detergent. Now I've just got half a cup here, but basically it's gonna be three of these because it's three parts. Oh, it's gonna take a bit of muscle from Cozy to squeeze this out. Wow, one. Oh, look how bright green it is. Two. Oh, squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Two. I'm excited. Three. Come on, Cozy. Use those muscles. Thank goodness I had my wheat bix this morning. Three. Okay, pop that there. Then we open our glycerin. Okay, I'm just gonna put that there. I'll clean up my mess later. Okay, so, oh, I haven't opened this yet. So we're gonna pour the glycerin into our half a cup. So it's just one part glycerin. All right, pour it in. Wee. Okay, maybe just get the spoon and mix it in. Take, scrape it out, sorry, I should say. All right, now we're going to slowly mix, not fast, because you don't want to make bubbles in the bowl. You want to make bubbles with your wand. So slowly mix. Now, just a little hint. It is best that you let this sit just for maybe about 12 hours, 24 hours if you want really good bubbles, but it will still work if you don't let it sit. I just want to tell you that it is good to just let it kind of really sink in and then that way you can have nice big bubbles. Wow, I'm excited to see if this is going to work or not. Okay, so slowly mix that in like we are. Okay, we could see with our bubble wand if it's gonna work. What do you reckon? I think we should. Okay, so put that down. Get our handy dandy bubble wand. I'm very proud of my bubble wand. These are really easy to make like I showed you and you could even make them at your party. If we're having a party and then the party guests get to take it home afterwards. Just an idea. Okay, pop that in. Ooh, pop it in, let it shake off. Oh. <gasps> Look, it worked. Our bubble mixture worked. Can you see that? It's still alive. Pop. <laughs> oh, that one's not gonna work so well. Oh my goodness, guys, this is so fun. Oh my goodness, look, our bubble wand is working and our bubble mixture is so fun. Oh, oh wow, I wonder if you're gonna get bigger bubbles than me. Maybe because we need to let it sit, it's gonna be even better. Oh, all right, mine keep popping. Let's just try a few more. Come on, come on, come on. Gosh, this is so cool. I hope you've had fun blowing bubbles with me. <laughs> See you next time on Cozy's Corner. 
Thanks for watching.